to them staying at the uh, Indigo Madrid Gran Via and this is an executive room um, 1007 okay, let's start with the uh, with the bathroom first but it has a little bit kind of interesting you know like a uh, green light so uh, you know you don't actually have to turn the lights on if you just you know go to wait we wash your hands let's use the toilet but I do prefer actually turning the <laughs> Turn the lights on, and uh, here's the rather tiny, tiny bathroom. I mean, a shower. Um, um, pardon, it's getting a bit late. I close to midnight, and uh, here's here's a uh, lighter look of the uh, bathroom that he is. So they have the amena line of stuff over here, and cream. I mean, wall mounted hair dryer, and uh, so here's the room itself. So here's the bed, so it's actually, um, it's not really a king, it's like a double bed. Um, and uh, here we have a, a live orchid. I love the fact they have a small amenity of, of red wine over here. And Spanish, um, Spanish meat over there. Um, we have a... That's not an espresso machine, is that? No, but it's just one of these fake machines, with, which, which actually does take those Nespresso poops. So maybe it's an espresso after all. Um, and so here's an analog of the bed. And as is always the case with these um, Indigo hotels, they have quite interesting um, uh, paper that they use on, on the ceilings. But uh, on this one, they only use the one behind the bed, because sometimes they use it like all over but not at this Indigo Hotel. I, I don't actually have anything else to say about this hotel right now because I just checked in literally like five minutes ago. But again, this is the Indigo Hotel Madrid Gran Villa, and this was an Executive King 10007.